Hey YouTube, hey Young and the Restless fans. So we saw in today's episode in the preview that there is going to be a serious situation here with Jordan and Claire and Harrison. Oh boy, <laughs> let's get into it. Okay, so we saw Victor and Nikki's anniversary party. It was very lovely. Everything went well and Nikki in the next episode will be worried that Jordan didn't show up, but we the fans know that she did, that she was lurking outside in disguise, okay? And she's going to see Claire now leave. And of course, Jordan has been kind of spying on the situation. She saw the connection that Claire and Harrison have and she even said, isn't that precious? You know, so we get this indication now that Jordan is going to do something to Claire and Harrison and try to ruin, you know, this situation and maybe, you know, set up Claire, okay? Because Jordan doesn't want Claire to have this nice family now, right? And she wants to ruin that for her. So Jordan's going to make it look like Claire did something, okay? And so what's gonna happen now is of course, Claire's gonna go to the Abbott Mansion. She's gonna return Harrison's lucky charm, the, the, the bunny, and Kyle's gonna be there and he's gonna let Claire in. And um, you know she's gonna return the, the lucky charm and Kyle's gonna ask her, her to stay and read a story too to Harrison. Harrison's gonna be happy that Claire's there. And um, they're gonna go upstairs and Claire is gonna be sitting on the bed. Harrison is gonna be in the bathroom and Claire is gonna be sitting on the bed and Jordan is going to be there, okay? And she's gonna come out of the shadows. Jordan's very resourceful. Uh, she's one of these super villains, right, on the show. She's amazing. She can do all of these things, but she's very dangerous and um, she's going to, um, sneak up on Claire and incapacitate her, okay? And then and then Harrison later as well, okay? Uh, 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 the, that's the assumption. So somehow, some way, um, Jordan is going to be there and she's going to be able to um, uh, take Claire and Harrison, okay? Kyle's gonna find out. Jack and Diane are gonna come home. Kyle's gonna be on the phone, you know, uh, with the police. And uh, and we see in the preview too, you know, you know, Jack and Diane are wondering what's going on. And Kyle says, I never should have trusted her with him, okay? So it looks like now Kyle is going to jump to the conclusion and assume that Claire it is behind this, that Claire's the one that took Harrison, okay? And of course we see uh, Summer uh, over at the tack house talking to Victoria and she's gonna say that both Claire and Harrison are missing, okay? So everyone is going to assume that Claire did this, okay? That's what Summer's gonna believe, Kyle's gonna believe that, uh, and Kyle's gonna you know, think that Summer was right not to trust Claire, okay? So, but we know, we the fans know that Claire is innocent, um, and that Jordan is the menace, <laughs> the one that's behind all of this, okay? So we'll have to see next week how all of this kind of unfolds and plays out, but it looks like um, Jordan will be keeping Claire and Harrison captive, okay? And at some point, that truth will become known, we'll have to see, but, but in the meantime, for now, um, it, it seems like everyone is gonna believe that Claire did this, except maybe Victoria, you know, and maybe a few others might not believe it. They might feel that Claire is a victim in this too. And of course, we the fans know that that's the truth, okay? But it's gonna make, some, look, it's gonna make it look like Summer was right all along about Claire. And uh, we'll have to see how Victor and Nikki react to this. Um, but, you know, Jordan, you know, has, has really wreaked, you know, a lot of havoc, right? She's caused a lot of chaos for the Newmans, and this is just the next uh, stage of that. So we'll have to see how all of this comes together, but we're in store for a wild week to come. It's going to be very exciting. Jordan is still out there. She's made her next move now. We know what that is. We'll have to see um, what she is going to do uh, with 
uh, Claire and Harrison, if they're able to escape, if there's a, going to be a big rescue uh, in the near future too, we'll have to see about that. It kind of reminds me of when Mariah, right, when Stitch, you know, was holding Mariah captive and, and Ray and Devon and Abby and everyone were able to rescue them. So we'll see if there's a big rescue. Uh, maybe Kyle, um, you know, is going to be part of that. We'll, we'll have to see how that all works out, but we're definitely in store for an exciting week. So let me know what you think. Um, Jordan is certainly, <laughs> she's, she's got to be up there now, you know, as one of the, the greatest villains, you know, in, 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 in soap opera. Um, maybe not history, but definitely, um, uh, you know, in, in that conversation, okay? And of course, on The Bold and the Beautiful, we're dealing with Sheila too, and there's a lot going on there that we'll get into uh, very soon too. But uh, let me know what you think, and let me know um, what you think, Jordan, if she's ever gonna get caught, if she's gonna get away with this, if this is gonna continue. Of course, Nikki now is gonna be totally horrified over all of this happening, and, and Victor too, so we'll have to see how everyone reacts to this, but uh, we're in store for a wild ride, so. So uh, get ready, it's gonna be another exciting week. And uh, hey, if you like this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.